Hi everyone, welcome to our project. The project is about street light. This project conducted by Chong Hua Ting, my group member, and I, Patricia Linan. Street light is a tour post with a light at the top and standby at the side of a road to light up the road so people or vehicles pass by will be able to see the road. Detail for our project Our project has developed a simplest logic secret to control a, a street light. There are three inputs and one output of this project which are trying to achieve our objectives below. Firstly, to improve the road safety at night day. Second, to improve the perception of the street. And third, to increase the leisure and commercial activity after dark day. Then, this is how the block diagram for street light looks like. This flowchart represents the operation of street light. The switch panel will turn on automatically if the vehicle or people pass by at the street. Next, the timer and the light sensor will turn on too. Then, the street light will turn on. However, the street light will turn off if nobody around that area. Next, truth table. The inputs and output are chosen to be A stand for switch panel, B stand for timer, C stand for light sensor, and Q for output which is LED the operation of the street light 1. the street light will on if the switch and timer are on 2. the timer and light sensor turn on or off when the switch turn on so the street light will turn on too We are using KMAP to simplify our boolean expression and we get the output Q is equal to A plus B not C. This is how the logic circuit diagram looks like by using logic tree, where A stands for switch panel, B stands for timer, C stands for Light sensor and Q stand for output LED. We will be able to present the simulation of the street light circuit by referring the truth table before. When all inputs A, B, C are equal to zero, then the outputs will be equal to zero. When A and B are equal to 0, but C equal to 1, the outputs will be 0 too. When A and C are equal to 0, but B equal to 1, the output will be 1. When A is equal to 0, but B and C are equal to 1, the output will be 0. When A is equal to 1, but B and C are equal to 0, the output will be 1, which means the switch are turned on, so that the output will be 1. When A and C are equal to 1, but B equal to 0, the output will be 1. When A and B are equal to 1, but C 
is equal to zero, the output will be one. When all inputs are equal to one, then the output will be one. That's all from us. Thank you.